Welcome back to Bible Quizzes. We have 80 questions again today, so let's get started. 1. What prophet walked around naked for three years? Ezekiel, Jeremiah, Isaiah, or Hosea? Isaiah, Isaiah 23, then the Lord said, just as my servant Isaiah has gone stripped and barefoot for three years as a sign and portent against Egypt and Cush. Two, who went naked as a way of wailing over the fate of Jerusalem, Amos, Micah, Joel, or Zephaniah? Micah, Micah 1 8. Because of this, I will weep and wail, and I will go about barefoot and naked. I will howl like a jackal and a moan like an owl. 3. What king of Israel struck with the power of the Shaprophesi, stripped off his clothes, and lay naked for a whole day and night? David, Solomon, Saul, or Ahab. Saul, 1 Samuel 19.24, he stripped off his garments and he too prophesied in Samuel's presence. He lay naked all that day and all that night. This is why people say, is Saul also among the prophets? 4. What father lay naked and intoxicated in his tent, which so disturbed his sons that they came and covered him? Adam, Lot, Abraham, or Noah? Noah, Genesis 9.21, when he drank some of its wine, he became drunk and lay uncovered inside his tent. 5. In war, what persons were often humiliated by being stripped? Soldiers, kings, priests, or captives? Captive, 2 Chronicles 28.15, the men designated my, by name took the prisoners and from the plunder they clothed all who were naked. They provided them with clothes and sandals, food and drink, and healed, healing balm. All those who were weak they put on donkeys, so they took them back to their fellow Israelites at Jericho, the city of Palms, and returned to Samaria. 6. What prophet threatened to take away the flax that covered his wife's nakedness? Hosea, Jeremiah, Isaiah, or Ezekiel? Hosea, Hosea 2, 4 through 6, I will not show my love to your children, because they are the children of for adultery. Their mother has been unfaithful and has conceived them in disgrace. She, she said, I will go after my lovers who give me my food and my water, my wool and my linen, my olive oil and my drink. Therefore, I will block her path with thorn brush bushes. I will, I will wall her in so that she cannot find her way. 7. What disciple, busy at his daily work, was caught naked by Jesus? James, Peter, John, or Thomas? 7. Peter, John 21, 7. Then the disciple whom Jesus loved said to Peter, It is the Lord. As soon as Simon Peter heard him say, It is the Lord, he wrapped his outer garment around him, for he had taken it off and jumped into the water. 8. Who embarrassed his wife by shamelessly exposing himself while dancing for joy? Solomon, Saul, David, or Samson? David, 2 Samuel 6.20 When David returned home to bless his household, Michal, daughter of Saul, came out to meet him and said, How the king of Israel has distinguished himself today, going around half-naked in full view of the slave girls of his servants as any vulgar fellow would. 9. Where did a follower of Jesus escape an angry mob by running away naked? Gethsemane, Galilee, Jerusalem, Bethlehem. Gethsemane, Mark 14, 51 52. Where did a follower of Jesus escape an angry mob by running away naked? 10. What prophet spoke of a woman, merely a symbol, who committed sexual sin while naked? Isaiah, Jeremiah, Hosea, or Ezekiel? Ezekiel. 
Ezekiel, Ezekiel 23.10, they exposed her nakedness, took away her sons and daughters, and killed her with the sword. She became a byword among women, and punishment was inflicted on her. 11. Whose entrancing dance approved fatal for John the Baptist? Salome, Esther, Herodias, or Miriam? Salome, Matthew 14, 6 through 8. On Herod's birthday, the daughter of Herodias danced for the guests and pleased Herod so much that he promised with an oath to give her whatever she asked. Prompted by her mother, she said, Give me here on a platter the head of John the Baptist. 12. Who held a feast with dancing when his son returned? Abraham, the father of the prodigal son, father of the shepherd, or Jacob? 15:25. Meanwhile, the older son was in the field. When he came near the house, he heard music and dancing. 13. Who laughed at Nehemiah's plans to rebuild Jerusalem? Sanballat, Tobiah, and Geshem, the Philistines, Herod and Pilate, or Pharaoh and his court? 3. Tobiah, and Geshem, Nehemiah 2.19, but when Sanballat the Horonite, Horonite, Tobiah the Ammonite official, and Geshem the Arab heard about it, they mocked and ridiculed us. What is this you are doing? They asked. Are you rebelling against the king? 14. Who danced with all his might when the Ark of the Covenant was brought to Jerusalem? Saul, Samuel, Solomon, or David? 2 Samuel 6.14 Wearing a linen ephah, David was dancing before the Lord with all his might. 15. Who laughed when she heard she would bear a son in her old age? Rebecca, Rachel, Sarah, or Hannah? 15. Sarah, Genesis 18.12 So Sarah laughed to herself as she thought, After I am worn out and my Lord is old, will I now have this pleasure? 16. Who was snickered at for claiming that a dead girl was only asleep? Elijah, Jesus, Elisha, or Peter? 16. Jesus, Matthew 9, 24. He said, Go away, the girl is not dead, but asleep. But they laughed at him. 17. What prophetess led the woman of Israel in victory dance? Deborah, Huldah, Miriam, or Anna? 16. Miriam, Exodus 15:20. Then Miriam the prophet, Aaron's sister, took a timbrel in her hand, and all the women followed her with timbrels and dancing. 17. What woman's laughter over being found out in a lie cost her husband his life? 18. Sapphira, Acts 5.9 Peter said to her, How could you conspire to test the spirit of the Lord? Listen, the feet of the men who buried your husband are at the door and they will carry you out also. 19. What king of Israel was ridiculed and laughed at by his wife for dancing? David, Peter, Saul, or Hezekiah? 19. David, 2 Samuel 6.20 When David returned home to bless his household, Michal, daughter of Saul, came out to meet him and said, How the king of Israel has distinguished himself today, going around half-naked in full view of the slave girls of his servants as any vulgar fellow would. 20. Who was the wife of Abraham that laughed when she heard she would have a child? Sarah, Rachel, Rebecca, or Leah? 20. Sarah, Genesis 18:12. So Sarah laughed to herself as she thought, After I am worn out and my Lord is old, I will now have this pleasure. 21. Rebecca is the only woman in the Bible whose age at death is recorded. 
false. Genesis 23.1 Sarah lived to be 127 years old. 22. Who was the first woman to become a judge over Israel? Deborah, Miriam, Esther, or Ruth? Deborah, Judges 4.4. Now Deborah, a prophet, the wife of Lapideth, was leading Israel at that time. 23. Who was a woman who saved her family by hiding the Israelite spies? Rahab, Naomi, Ruth, or Jael? Rahab, Joshua 2.4. But the woman had taken the two men and hidden them. 24. Who was the widow that provided food and shelter for the prophet Elijah? The widow of Zarephath, the widow of Nain, the Shunammite woman, or the widow with two mites? The widow of Zarephath. 1 Kings 17.12 But she said, As surely as the Lord your God lives, I don't have any bread, only a handful of flour in a jar and a little olive oil in a jug. 25. Who is the woman who saved your city by appealing to King David? Abigail, the wise woman of Gethsemane, wise woman of Abel Beth Makkah, or Tamar of Bethlehem? The wise woman of Abel Beth Makkah. 2 Samuel 20, 22. Then the woman went to all the people with her wise advice, and they cut off the head of Sheba, son of Bikri, and threw it to Joab. So he sounded the trumpet, and his men dispersed from the city, each returning to his home, and Joab went back to the king in Jerusalem. 26. Who was the mother of John the Baptist? Mary, Bathsheba, Elizabeth, or Tamar? Elizabeth, Luke 1, 23-24, when his time of service was completed, he returned home. After this, his wife Elizabeth became pregnant and for five months remained in seclusion. 27. Who was the first Christian convert in Europe? Priscilla, Dorcas, Phoebe, or Lydia? Lydia. Acts 16.14 One of those listening was a woman from the city of Thyatira named Lydia, a dealer in purple cloth. She was a worshiper of God. The Lord opened her heart to respond to Paul's message. 28. Who was a woman who led the Israelites in a song of triumph after crossing the Red Sea? Miriam, Hannah, Deborah, or Esther? Miriam, Exodus 15, 20, the Mir then Miriam the prophet Aaron's sister took a timbrel in her hand and all the women followed her with timbrels and dance. 29, who was the woman that saved the Hebrew spies in Jericho? Rahab, Joshua 2, 4, but the woman had taken the two men and hidden them. 30. Who was the queen who risked her life to save her people? Vashti, Jezebel, Esther, Bathsheba. Esther, Esther 4.16, then I will go to the king, though it is against the law, and if I perish, I perish. 31. Who tricked his brother out of the birth his birthright? Esau, Joseph, Jacob, or Benjamin? Jacob, Genesis 25, 30 to 31. He said to Jacob, Quick, let me have some of that red stew. I'm famished. That is why he was also called Edom. Jacob replied, First, sell me your birthright. 32. Who was the judge of Israel that outwitted the Philistines with the riddle? Gideon, Ehud, David, or Samson? Samson, Judges 14, 12, let me tell you a riddle, Samson said to them. If you can give me the answer within the seven days of the feast, I will give you thirty linen garments and thirty sets of clothes. 33. Who deceived the king of Gerar by saying his wife was his sister? Abraham, Ezekiel, Isaiah, or Jacob?
Abraham, Genesis 22. So Abraham said of Sarah, his wife, she is my sister, and Abimelech, king of Gerar, sent for Sarah and took her. 34. Who tricked Samson into revealing the secret of his strength? Delilah, Jezebel, Michal, or Tamar? Delilah, Judges 16, 17. So he told her everything. No razor has ever been used on my head, he said, because I have been a Nazarite dedicated to God from my mother's womb. If my head were shaved, my strength would leave me, and I would become as weak as any other man. 35. Who disguised herself to avoid being recognized as she thought, sought help from a prophet? Tamar's wife, Lot's wife, Jeroboam's wife, or Saul's wife? Jeroboam's wife. 1 Kings 14, 4-5. Now Ahijah could not see. His sight was gone because of his age. But the Lord had told Ahijah, Jeroboam's wife is coming to ask you about her son, for he is ill, and you are to give her such and such an answer. When she arrives, she will pretend to be someone else. 36. Who tricked Laban by running away with his daughters and household gods? Jacob, Joseph, Esau, or Benjamin? Jacob, Genesis 31 20. Moreover, Jacob deceived Laban the Aramean by not telling him he was running away. 37. Who outwitted King Saul by letting David escape through a window? Michal, Bathsheba, Abigail, or Hannah? Michal, 1 Samuel 19, 11-12, but Michal, David's wife, warned him, if you don't run for your life tonight, tomorrow you'll be killed. So Michal let David down through a window, and he fled and escaped. 38. Who tricked Jacob into marrying her instead of her sister, Leah, Zilpah, Rachel, or Bilhah? Leah, Genesis 29-25, when morning came, there was Leah, so Jacob said to Laban, What is this you have done to me? I served you for Rachel, didn't I? Why have you deceived me? 39, who pretended to be Esau to receive his father's blessing? Reuben, Simeon, Levi, or Jacob? Jacob, Genesis 27-19, Jacob said to his father, I am Esau, your firstborn. I have done as you told me. Please sit up and eat some of my game, so that you may give me your blessing. 40. What animal did Noah release from the ark first? Dove, raven, sparrow, or pigeon? Raven. Genesis 8-7, then he sent out a raven, and it kept flying back and forth until the water had dried up from the earth. 41, a sheep spoke to Balaam. False, Numbers 22-28, then his wife said to him, Do you still hold fast your integrity? Curse God and die then. The Lord opened the donkey's mouth and said to Balaam, What have I done to you to make you beat me these three times? 42, what kind of bird brought Elijah food while he hid by the brook Cherith? Raven, sparrow, dove, or eagle? Raven, 1 Kings 17, 6. The ravens brought him bread and meat in the morning and brought him meat in the evening, and he drank from the brook. 43. What creature licked the sores of Lazarus the beggar? Cat, pig, dog, or cow? Dog, Luke 16, 21. Even the dogs came and licked his sores. 44. What animal did God provide as a sacrifice in place of Isaac? Ram, goat, lamb, or calf?
ram. Genesis 22:13. Abraham looked up and there in a thicket he saw a ram caught by its horns. He went over and took the ram and sacrificed it as a burnt offering instead of his son. 45. What animals did Jesus cast the demons into? Pigs. Matthew 8.32 He said to them, Go. So they came out and went to the pigs, and the whole herd rushed down the steep bank into the lake and died in the water. 46. What bird did Jesus mention when he talked about how God cares for his creation? Eagle, dove, sparrow, or raven? Sparrow, Matthew 10, 29. Are not two sparrows sold for a penny, yet not one of them will fall to the ground outside your father's care? 47. What fish swallowed Jonah? Whale, dolphin, shark, or giant fish? Giant fish, Jonah 1.17, now the Lord provided a huge fish to swallow Jonah, and Jonah was in the belly of the fish three days and three nights. 48. What kind of bird brought the olive leaf back to Noah? Raven, pigeon, sparrow, or dove? Dove. Genesis 8.11 When the dove returned to him in the evening, there in its beak was a freshly plucked olive leaf. Then Noah knew that the water had receded from the earth. 49. What insect did John the Baptist eat in the wilderness? Locusts, ants, bees, or crickets? Locusts. Matthew 3.4 His food was locusts and wild honey. 50. Ezekiel was swallowed by what? By a giant fish. False. Jonah 117. Now the Lord provided a huge fish to swallow Jonah, and Jonah was in the belly of the fish three days and three nights. 51. Which prophet saw the vision of the valley of dry bones? Isaiah, Daniel, Ezekiel, or Jeremiah? Ezekiel, Ezekiel 37, 1. The hand of the Lord was on me, and he brought me out by the Spirit of the Lord and set me in the middle of a valley. It was full of bones. 52. Which prophet prophesied the virgin birth of Jesus? Isaiah, Hosea, Jeremiah, or Micah? Isaiah, Isaiah 7.14, Therefore the Lord himself will give you a sign. The virgin will conceive and give birth to a son, and will call him Emmanuel. 53, which prophet message to Nineveh led to the city's repentance? Jonah, Nahum, Micah, or Amos? Jonah, Jonah 3, 4 through 5. Jonah began by going a day's journey into the city, proclaiming, 40 more days in Nineveh will be overthrown. The Ninevites believed God. 54. Which prophet saw the vision of the four beasts? Daniel, Daniel 7, 2-3 In my vision at night I looked, and there before me were four winds of heaven, churning up the great sea. Four great beasts, each different from the others, came up out of the sea. 55. Which prophet confronted King David about his sin with Bathsheba? Samuel, Gad, Nathan, or Ahijah? Nathan, 2 Samuel 12, 7. Then Nathan said to David, You are the man. This is what the Lord, the God of Israel, says. I anointed you king over Israel, and I delivered you from the hand of Saul. 56. Which prophet foretold the birthplace of Jesus? Isaiah, Hosea, Jeremiah, or Micah? Micah, Micah 5.2, But you, Bethlehem Ephrathah, 
Though you are small among the clans of Judah, out of you will come for me one who will be ruler over Israel, whose origins are from of old, from ancient times. 57. What did Jesus do to calm the storm? Prayed, asked disciples to row harder, raised his hands, or spoke to the storm. Spoke to the storm. Mark 4.39 He got up, rebuked the wind, and said to the waves, Quiet, be still. Then the wind died down, and it was completely calm. 58. Who walked on water with Jesus? John, James, Peter, or Andrew? 14, 29. Come, he said. Then Peter got down out of the boat, walked on the water, and came toward Jesus. 59. How many people did Jesus feed with five loaves and two fish? 1,000, 3,000, 3,000, or 5,000? 5,000. Matthew 14, 21. The number of those who ate was about 5,000 men besides women and children. 60. How many lepers did Jesus heal at once? 1, 10, 5, or 12? 10. Luke 17, 14. When he saw them, he said, Go, show yourselves to the priests, and as they went, they were cleansed. 61. In the parable of the Good Samaritan, who passed by the injured man first? Priest, Samaritan, Levite, or tax collector? 61. Priest. Luke 10.31. A priest happened to be going down the same road, and when he saw the man, he passed by on the other side. 62. If the par in the parable of the sower, what happened to the seed that fell on rocky places? It was eaten by birds, it was choked by thorns, withered because it had no root, or produced a crop. 63. It withered because it had no root. Matthew 13, 5-6. Some fell on rocky places where it did not have much soil. It sprang up quickly because the soil was shallow, but when the sun, sun came up, the plants were scorched and they withered because they had no root. 63. In the parable of the prodigal son, what did the father give his returning son? A robe, a ring and sandals, a new house, a feast with a fattened calf, or gold and silver? A robe, a ring, and sandals. Luke 15, 22. But the father said to his servants, Quick, bring the best robe and put it on him. Put a ring on his finger and sandals on his feet. 64. In the parable of the talents, how many talents did the master give to the first servant? 3, 19, 5, or 10. 5. Matthew 25, 15. To the one he gave five talents, to another two, and to another one, he, each according to his ability. 65. In the parable of the ten virgins, what were the wise virgins prepared with? Extra oil for their lamps, warm clothing, food and water, or gold and silver? 25.4 The wise ones, however, took oil in jars along with their lamps. 66. In the parable of the mustard seed, what does the mustard seed grow into? Small plant, vine, tree, or bush? 3. Matthew 13, 32. Though it is the smallest of all seeds, yet when it grows it is the largest of garden plants and becomes a tree so that the birds come and perch in its branches. 67. In the parable of the lost sheep, how many sheep did the shepherd leave to find the one that was lost? 50, 76, 99, or 75? 
99. Luke 15, 4. Suppose one of you has a hundred sheep and loses one of them. Doesn't he leave the 99 in the open country to go after the lost sheep until he finds it? 68. In the parable of the rich man and Lazarus, where did Lazarus go after he died? Heaven, hell, Abraham's side, or purgatory? 69. Abraham sighed. Luke 16.22 The time came when the beggar died and the angels carried him to Abraham's side. The rich man also died and was buried. 69. In the parable of the workers in the vineyard, what did the landowner pay the workers? Different wages based on their work? Nothing. The same wages regardless of their work or double the wages. 69. Same wages regardless of their work. Matthew 20.16. So the last will be first and the first will be last. 70. In the parable of the wedding banquet, who were the first invited guests? Friends of the king, enemies of the king, servants of the king, or strangers in the streets? 71. Friends of the king, Matthew 22, 3. He sent his servants to those who had been invited to the banquet to tell them to come, but they refused to come. 71. What is the greatest commandment according to Jesus? Love your neighbor as yourself. Love the Lord your God with all your heart. Do not steal or honor your mother and father. 72. Love the Lord your God with all your heart. Matthew 22, 37 to 38. Jesus replied, Love the Lord your God with all your heart, with all your soul, with all your mind. This is the first and greatest commandment. 72. What's the second greatest commandment according to Jesus? Do not lie, love your neighbor as yourself, do not covet, or do not kill. 72. Love your neighbor as yourself. Matthew 22, 39. And the second is like it. Love your neighbor as yourself. 73. What did Jesus teach about worrying? Worry about everything? Do not worry about your life. Worry about important things or worry about what you will eat and drink. 74. Do not worry about your life. Matthew 6.25 Therefore I tell you, do not worry about your life, what you will eat or drink, or about your body, what you will wear. 74. According to Jesus, who is the greatest in the kingdom of heaven? Wealthy, those who serve others, most religious, or little children? 75. Little children. Matthew 18.4. Therefore, whoever takes the lowly position of this child is the greatest in the kingdom of heaven. 75. What did Jesus say about the way to the Father? Through good works, through him, following the law, or through sacrifices. 72. Through him. John 14, 6. Jesus answered, I am the way and the truth and the life. No one comes to the Father except through me. 76. What did Jesus teach about forgiveness? Forgive once, forgive seven times, forgive three times, or forgive 77 times. Forgive 77 times. Matthew 18, 22. Jesus answered, I tell you, not seven times, but 77 times. 77. What did Jesus say about judging others? Judge fairly? Do not judge or you too will be judged. Judge according to the law or judge with mercy. 72. Do not judge or you too will be judged. Matthew 7, 1. Do not judge or you too will be judged. 78. What did Jesus teach about prayer? Pray in public to be seen? Pray only in the temple? Use many words or pray in secret? 
pray in secret, Matthew 6.6, 6, but when you pray, go into your room, close the door, and pray to your Father who is unseen. 79. What did Jesus say about wealth? Store up your treasures on earth? Seek wealth to help others? Wealth is a sign of God's favor? Or you cannot serve both God and money? You cannot serve both God and money. Matthew 6.24 No one can serve two masters. Either you'll ha hate the one and love the other, or you'll be devoted to the one and despise the other. You cannot serve both God and money. 80. What did Jesus say about the way to eternal life? Broad and easy? Fo by following the commandments? Narrow and difficult? Or by attending church? Narrow and difficult, Matthew 7.14, but small is the gate and narrow the road that leads to life and only a few find it. And that's all our questions today, so let us know how you did down below and share this with your friends and family, and then we'll see you guys in the next one.